Hey there, it's Andrew Abyss. How you doing? Thank you all for spreading the message about Fukushima. Now, we have to get the word out, so I'd like to announce a an Abyss Studios competition. Now, this competition uh, has two parts. First of all, I want you to um, uh, set up a radiation protest hotspot or protest location, uh, like a clinic that uh, uh, educates, that you're obviously protesting, but also educating people, handing out um, information. Uh, now, uh, I want to promote my, um, my movies, and the latest movie to come out very soon, uh, on Fukushima Beach 3. Uh, so, uh, I, want, I would like your uh, protest to have anywhere on its signage, um, Google search, or start page search, or search, uh, on Fukushima Beach. Okay, printed uh, anywhere. Uh, on your protest signage. Now it doesn't have to be the most prominent uh, signage, uh, part of your uh, message. Uh, it, you could be, it could be the uh, headline, or it could be a sub-headline uh, of your protest. On a banner, on a placard, um, large, uh, medium size. Um, if, you're, if you're just doing a small placard, like a just on the side of the street, um, you know, obviously it has to be printed somewhere like that. So Google search or start page search, search on Fukushima Beach. Uh, okay, now the prize for the best um, for the best uh, protest site, large or small, um, will be uh, a 20 gram uh, gold bar. So 20 grams of gold, that's uh, easily $900, $1,000 worth, the current prices and um, so that's a nice reward. Uh, you know, obviously it'd be nice to be more, but that's all I can um, really shell out right now. So uh, now, obviously, I need at least 50 entrants to make this viable. So if I don't get 50 entrants, uh, it's, this is not going ahead. So please remix this, spread the word. Um, I really would appreciate that. Now, uh, yeah. So while I want uh, the banner. Uh, placard to say Google search uh, on Fukushima Beach. It, as, as I said before, it doesn't have to be the most prominent uh, message on your placard or banner. It can be um, uh, Plumegate, uh, the scandal that, uh, the radiation scandal, whatever. It can be radiation in the Pacific or uh, anything you think spreads the message about what's going on. Uh, it has to be something catchy, a headline. Um, for me, on, on Fukushima Beach is good, that's just my opinion, but uh, you may differ completely. Um, if they link to on Fukushima Beach, they'll get you know a full um, couple of movies and a third movie to come. That really, uh, I tried to set out what's going on in that, so it encapsulates, encapsulates it in a, um, in a digestible film form. Um, so, but uh, yeah, definitely, uh, you may... Um, you may not want that to be the most prominent uh, message on your banner. And um, so it, you may not want to um, even uh, have any of that and, and do something, you know, that doesn't mention my movie at all. But I, I would like this contest to take place on a coordinated date. And that date would be uh, September 14. So, yeah, condition one is that the, the, the banner has on Fukushima Beach, search on Fukushima Beach somewhere. The condition two is that you must have some ha uh, handouts or um, flyers or paraphernalia that promotes these sites that, that are listed um, currently. So please look at these sites and please place them on, the, um, on your paraphernalia that you hand out. And uh, condition three, condition three is that you, on the paraphernalia it must mention uh, Kevin D. Blanche's um, march on Washington that I believe is September 28. Must mention that with information how to contact him. You know, as many places across the globe as possible. Uh, you can enter, of course, from uh, other countries, not even non-English speaking countries. So um, if anyone out there can remix this video and translate what I'm saying into, uh, into um, Spanish or Portuguese, uh, Chinese, whatever, uh, you're, you are as, uh, as well. Um, you can enter this contest and win that 20 gram uh, gold gold bar. Um, now, uh, for Japanese, um, there's a translated version of uh, Fukushima Beach. It's called uh, Fukushima no Umi in kanji. So uh, 
that would probably have so that would probably be your search term uh, Google search Fukushima no Umi uh, because there's a version of that there's also a Spanish version called uh, uh, in La Playa de Fukushima so you can use that if you're a Spanish speaking protest you must uh, do your best to um, take down names and emails of interested parties who, would, who are interested in in um, uh, marching further or contributing some way just receiving information about Fukushima and um, and I, I don't want these email lists I want you to keep them uh, because um, with the information that we're all um, getting we can um, spread out that information and invite people to protest gatherings uh, because the idea is to eventually have um, such a uh, a uh, an awakening that um, you know, people are marching on capitals and uh, you know in their cities uh, just we need to garner as much support as possible that's what the uh, the um, the contest is all about so I want you to keep those email lists and uh, and uh, keep them for um, a later battle you could say um, another condition last condition I believe so many conditions I don't think they're too difficult to fulfill um, is that um, you uh, must subscribe to my channel because um, that's how you're going to uh, prove to me that uh, you are an entry. So you can you can private message me that uh, you'd like to enter, uh, but um, uh, if I don't have a subscription to my channel, I can't uh, I can't really um, assess your entry. Now, the, the the reason why I need your subscription is because yeah, obviously I want to. Uh, get lots of subscribers and uh, spread my uh, movies, my message, uh, and messages of other uh, activists. Um, but also, I, the way you're going to, the way I'm going to judge this is, uh, I want you to shoot a short video of your protest site uh, in a short five-minute movie. Um, uh, I, don't, I think five minutes uh, is is long enough. It doesn't have to be uh, really nicely edited. It can be just like a, an iPhone movie. But uh, hopefully the movie will show the uh, ingenuity, uh, the impact. Uh, that's what I'm looking for, the impact. So you, you could have an amazing protest site with an effigy of Barack Obama and Jeffrey Emelt that, uh, that are talking, um, you know, <laughs> telling lies, uh, um, an articulated effigy even. But uh, you could, I could see that you're only, uh, you've only attracted, uh, it's not a very prominent site, it's like in a back alley and, and no one sees it. So, um, so it could be really ingenious like that, but uh, no one's looking at it. So that would obviously not be a winner. I mean, you've gone to so much effort to to make these clever um, uh, effigy. Maybe you've made these reactors, uh, reactor models, just little little craft models of the reactors, to, just to demonstrate what's going on and the, you know, how it's releasing radiation. Maybe that's you've you've done all that. Uh, and you've got a, a really nice banner, whatever, but you're in a back alley and, you know, there's no impact there. So um, if someone's on a, you know, like a, a very um, much traveled on street corner with a placard and uh, they're handing out, you can see, I can see they're handing out hundreds of flyers and, and engaging people um, about what's going on. Um, uh, that's, that's more impactful than, you know, the, the first example. So... I would rate that as a, a much stronger entry, a much greater chance or chance of winning. So by this contest, I want to create a concentration impact about Fukushima on a date simultaneously uh, around the world. So uh, please remix this video. Let me know what you think, um, and uh, you know, tell me if I'm you know, where I, I may be going wrong. Some people may say, oh, it's wrong to seek a, a cash or a remuneration for protesting, but uh, this is just to get a uh, competition, a healthy competition. Participating is the, the victory here. Um, if there's sour grapes about, about who wins, uh, I can't help you there. I would like to create sort of a, um, a judging panel, maybe myself, uh, maybe Miss Milky the Clown and Red Button Studio, because I love you guys. Um, uh, just so it's more balanced and um, if you you guys would like to be on the judging panel <laughs> anyway but um so that that'll be fun um all right so that's the main part of the of the competition 
So hopefully I haven't missed out anything. I'll make more announcements. Um, the second part of the competition is a second prize. Now it's not second place, but um, I want to also have a, um, a competition for the best um, standalone banner hang. You know, um, so if you have some bunting or a large banner you want to put on a uh, prominent prominent building that's legal, maybe an over um, a highway overpass, um, or has to be legal with your you know local authorities, uh, chalking, a large standalone chalk. Uh, obviously when it's standalone, uh, just so you put a banner on a building, you can't really engage people or hand out paraphernalia. Um, so this is a sort of a separate competition, but it's on the same date, September 14. Now, the condition of this is that it's, it's, it's uh, the banner, pro, um, uh, bunting must have Google search on Fukushima Beach, somewhere on it again doesn't have to be the most prominent message it may be radiation in the pacific google um on fukushima beach google plume gate um just as long as um on fukushima beach, no, on fukushima beach is somewhere on the on the banner the standalone banner so if it's on a building it's, if it's a large chalking uh you could hand out paraphernalia um if it's a large chalk uh you know you could stand near it um, yeah, so the prize for the best one of those will be uh, a 10 gram gold bar. So 10 grams of gold. I don't want to ent ent enter any um, arguments about whether gold's a good investment. You know, it's not interesting to me. But um, certainly, if there's a group of three or four of you, you could uh, 20 grams of gold could certainly buy you a, a very a very good uh, night out. It could certainly recoup any more than the costs of setting up your clinic and you know ultimately this is just a um a way to stir a bit of you know healthy uh, productive competition among us uh, and get us all out there so that's the most important thing we need to, to get out there and um you know because you know making movies is great uh making your own youtube videos and um uh all, all the other things people have done it's 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 very very important but i think we need to be out there and and support um marches um, Kevin D. Blanche is marching on Washington, so that's very exciting. Now, so I want you to join him there. Uh, now, also, um, there's going to be a, a no nukes protest in Tokyo, I believe, on uh, October 13, I think. Yeah, and um, so that's that's great, I and mean, that's very, very important. But I think for us, um, we the no nukes protest is really sort of a a, a to and fro debate about oh is nu are nukes bad uh, are nuclear plants safe and there's this endless sort of procession of debate but uh, what we're saying is that you know forget about the debate we are um, there's you know <laughs> nuclear plants or not there's radioactive um, water going into the Pacific there's you know, you know radioactive plumes going on to North America uh, you know in Tokyo people are dying they're dying slowly and uh, they're going to die at 32 25 20 um, 10 years old, uh, there, there's already mutations and, uh, and un, unheralded deaths happening now. So uh, it's not a debate about, yes, is it good, is it bad, you know, is it red, red versus blue. No, this is like uh, we're fighting and then there's this big boulder uh, coming at the both of us and saying, you know, stop what you're doing. You know, it's not about whether it's nuclear power is good or not. There's Nuclear, that, that's important an important debate, but uh, there's um, there's a huge nuclear bowling ball headed straight at us, and we, we've got to start moving, you know, <laughs> work together to stop that ball um, crashing into us. So, uh, yeah, that's that's my, that's why I, I, I really want to start this contest. Um, so please subscribe to my channel. Please remix this. Yeah, if you want to, if you don't uh, believe or trust me, um, you know, the, the tag of Cointel Pro go, goes around very easily on YouTube, but um, uh, there's going to be hopefully people protesting uh, on September 14 because of this contest, but if you want to uh, protest on the same date, uh, have nothing to do with um, on Fukushima Beach, that's great, but uh, as long as you're spreading the message about radiation in the, in the Pacific, Plume Gate, um, yeah, Obama's ties to uh, nuclear industry. Um, yeah, do it. September 14. 
um, if there's inc inclement weather on that date, you can do your protest um, very close to that date, September 15, September 13, whatever. I understand that. So um, please send, uh, subscribe, send me the video, and you'll be considered uh, as being entry. But please also observe those conditions that I outlined before. Please watch this video again if, as many times as you need to uh, outline the conditions. If you're not understanding something or have missed something, please let me know. Okay, I'm sorry if I have. So uh, please get going. You've got uh, um, just over a month. Uh, and support Kevin D. Blanche, support uh, the Fukushima Truth Movement, and uh, 20 grams of gold, 10 grams of gold, uh, not a bad price. All right, Andrew Bissout, look out for my movie um, preview, it's coming soon, and um, hope to see you all very soon. Take care, bye.